We are learning new information as we're on the air here at 530 as we continue to follow breaking news this morning. Investigators are still on the scene in East Toledo after a body was found in a burned car. Yeah, Stephen Jackson joins us live near that scene this morning. And Stephen, we know that you just got that new information minutes ago. I did, Tim and Tiffany, and Toledo police telling me this morning that this is being investigated as a suspicious death. Just take a look over my shoulder. You can see police activity still going on right under the Veterans Glass City Skyway. So I'm being told this morning that there was no identification found on the person inside of that burned vehicle, so they can't confirm the gender at this time. Police also not able to identify the make and model of the vehicle because it was burned so bad. Badly. And investigators, they tell me that they will be staying out here for several hours until daylight comes so that they can comb through the scene. Now, this first call came in around 1.30 this morning about a fire. And then when police and Toledo Fire arrived, they found a fire near the Front Street exit ramp. So that's near I-280. So this is a pretty tough spot, a grassy area. And you can see from our live shot this morning, pretty dark over here. But crews again they tell me this is being investigated as a suspicious death so they will be out here for several hours again just working to find clues to figure out exactly who that person is who was found in that burned vehicle and exactly how all of this happened i will continue to bring you the latest developments reporting live this morning in east toledo i'm stephen jackson wtol 11. Stephen, thanks so much. Well, you can stick with us here on WTOL 11 as Stephen continues to get the latest developments there from the scene. We'll update you both online and on air as they come in. Yeah, definitely a very fluid situation this morning.